डियर स्टूडेंट्स अस्सलाम वालेकुम एंड वेलकम टू द सेकंड लेक्चर ऑफ मॉडर्न इंग्लिश बुक फॉर केस टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डू द एक्सरसाइज ऑफ यूनिट नंबर वन नाउ लेट्स स्टार्ट आंसर दिस क्वेश्चन ब्रीफली इन योर नोटबुक वट डज द पोइट्स मदर लाइक टू डू द पोइट्स मदर वॉन्ट्स टू ब्रिंग इज अप एज अ गुड ह्यूमन बींग वाई विल द पोइट नोट टीज हर मदर His father told him not to tease his mother because she is very kind and has two patients. Question number 3 what does she do when she overlooks mistakes? When she overlooks our mistakes she gives us hug. Question number 4 should we break her trust? No, we should not break her trust. Question number 5 do we love her? Yes, we love her. 6 question number 6 does she live, loves us? Yes, she loves us. Answer these questions in detail. What is the main theme of the poem? The main theme of the poem is mother. Question number two. What are the most important thing you have read? The most important thing I have read that mother is very precious thing in this world. She overlooks our mistake. We should not tease her and should not break her trust. Question number three. Did you learn any new fact from poem? Yes, I learned the importance of mother in our life. C part. What was your favorite part of the poem? My favorite part of the poem is first part because in this part, poet describes the mother's characteristics very well. Circle the pairs of words which rhyme with each other. काइंड माइंड प्लीज टीज पिलर फिलर डियर स्टूडेंट्स यहाँ पर आपको कुछ राइमिक वर्ड्स नजर आ रहे हैं और जो साउंड में सेम है आप उनको सर्कल से मैच करेंगे उनके गिर्द आप सर्कल ड्रॉ कर देंगे लाइक दिस ई पार्ट थिंक ऑफ सम मोर राइमिंग वर्ड्स एंड राइट मदर अदर ब्रदर फर्दर हग मग ढग जग tells bells 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 dear students next question is this read the given words with their meanings and make sentences in your notebook words meanings are these meanings are these and words are these words meanings these make fun or attempt to provoke and sentence is this Don't tease other kind soft hearted my father is very kind mistakes fall my mother all looks or mistakes pillars a person or something which very important my grandfather is a pillar of our family core to be the center of something my mother is a real core comrade friend she is my best comrade circle the pair of words that rhymes with each other kind mind say day read indeed see par fill more rhyming words in the blank tease cheese peace core more door mother other brother Dear students our next question is about grammar there are different types of nouns common noun proper noun collective noun the name given to a non specific person or thing students teacher man woman animal dinosaur meat cheese proper noun refers to a specific person or thing and require a capital letter shiraz august Shakespeare's Islamabad collective noun used for a collection of people or things university organization army family library flock abstract describe a concept feeling or emotion ability hunger anger happiness consideration freedom ability intelligence thoughts purpose belief dear students 
Identify proper nouns, common nouns, and collective nouns in the following sentences at right in your notebooks. Dear students, यहाँ पर आपके लिए कुछ sentences दिए गए हैं आप इनमें proper noun, common noun और collective noun को find करेंगे और underline करेंगे We went to a group of island near Maldives. Maldives is proper noun and group of island is collective noun. Ali punched a hive of bees mistakenly and got stung. Now his fingers are swollen. Ali is proper noun. Hive of bees is collective noun. Fingers are common noun. A fleet of ships went missing in the Atlantic Ocean due to a series of tsunamis. Fleet of ships is collective noun. Atlantic Ocean is proper noun. Tsunamis is also proper noun. Our family photographs are di displayed on the side walls. Family photographs is proper noun. Side walls are common noun. We have a secret library of books in our house. Secret library is proper noun. Books and house is common noun. A pack of wolves were wandering through the forest of trees at night. Pack of wolves is collective noun. Forest of trees is also collective noun. One of my cousins is a PhD holder in neuroscience. Neuroscience is proper noun and cousins is common noun. Dr. Abdul Salam was a renowned scientist of Pakistan. Dr. Abdul Salam is proper noun. Pakistan is proper noun. And scientist is common noun. Abdul Star Eidi was known as the angel of mercy. Abdul Star Eidi is proper noun. Angel is common noun. A crowd of spectators gathered around the horrific accident. Crowd of spectators is collective noun. All a magician's need is a pack of cards to perform. Pack of cards is collective noun. Magician's is common noun. A litter of puppies. Litter of puppies were found in the abandoned building. Litter of puppies is collective noun. Building is abandoned. Building is building is common noun. Munza's valleys attract flock of tourists very year in the winter season. Munza's valleys is proper noun. Flock of tourists is collective noun. The night sky gives you a vision to a galaxy of stars at night time. Galaxy of stars is collective noun. Night sky is proper noun. The northern Pakistan has a beautiful range of mountains. Range of mountains is collective noun and northern Pakistan is proper noun. Next question is or or question. Read the following verse starting with vowel sounds. Pyaare bachyo, aap isko oral mein padhenge. Earth, ability, umbrella, iceberg, obesity. Next B part, read the following verse and write the verse that begins with a vowel sound. Uniform, envelope, forest, tease, enough, ostrich, informed, unknown, alligator, cake. Pari bacho, yahaan par aap kuch lines draw na, hui nazir aari hongi aapko. Aap dekh rahe hongi in lines ko yahaan par draw huye. آپ نے یہاں پر وہ ورڈ رائٹ کرنے ہیں جو وال ورڈ سے سٹارٹ ہوتے ہیں سی پارٹ ورڈ آر دا تھنگز یور پیرنٹس ڈو فور یو ڈسکس وید یور فرینڈس اینڈ کم فارورڈ ون بائی ون ٹو ٹیل دا کلاس ٹیک ہیلپ فرام دا گیون کلوز ڈیئر اسٹوڈینٹس تھینکس فار واچنگ اللہ حافظ